So the premium monofocal lens. So the ordinary lens is called a monofocal lens, and that's the one which we commonly use and has been in use for the longest period of time, and it's the common lens that we tend to put into patients on the NHS. Now the premium monofocal lens aims to give you a little bit more than that. I'm always cautious about the name premium because it makes it sound like if you throw money at something then you'll get super duper stuff. But it is a slightly better lens with the emphasis on slightly. It's not a miraculous improvement that over and above the ordinary lens and the ordinary lens that people get on the NHS is still a good lens. It restores vision and it's very good. So it's important you know that because once you cure the cataract, you're better. And people who have NHS cataract surgery are delighted with it. These lenses offer a little bit more, but they do come at a premium, hence the name of the premium. They're designed to give you distance and some degree of intermediate vision as well. The, there are lots on the market now and they work in slightly different ways, but effectively, if you, if you just think about it as if the lens itself has a curvature and in the middle, it's a little bit steeper to increase the amount of focus you get when you're looking close up. The aim, and the aim, it's an aim, not a guarantee, is to give you distance and intermediate vision at the same time. Now, the intermediate vision is important when you're looking at your phone, you're looking at, at your laptop, but there is no guarantee about this and strangely some patients do not seem to be able to cash that in. It works best when both eyes are done because you get two distance images and two intermediate images that you can see. There are some patients where it doesn't cash in at all and they just see distance but their intermediate vision is very poor and I don't really understand why. Equally there are other patients who are getting reading vision without spectacles on which is fantastic and I'm not going to complain about but again I don't understand why some patients are doing so well and some patients are doing less well with them but most patients do achieve some degree of intermediate vision. Now the aim is to give you distance vision, intermediate vision, but not reading vision. But if we do want to be clever, then we can offset it a little bit and give you something called monovision or micro monovision to try and give you depth of focus and try and set your eyes to slightly different distances in order to give you distance, intermediate and some degree of near vision. And certainly my experiences with them, it seems to be working very well. The most fundamental benefit of this is that it doesn't work in a clever way. You don't have light focus at different places, which can be the issue with the extended depth of focus lenses, the bifocal lenses, or the multifocal lenses. So these work in a very simple way, so theoretically you don't get any glare or halos or any other issues due to the light intensity reduction. So you get all the benefits with very few downsides, and that's why I'm quite a fan of these lenses. As I say, there are lots of different sorts. I'm not really going to comment on a different sort because they all seem to work very well and much and muchness. They've only been out for a handful of years, but you know, I'm, I'm putting them in regularly and I find them very, very good. So mention to your um, surgeon about them and they may even have to do them and routine, sort of routinely do them. If you do have astigmatism as well, then potentially you could benefit from a toric variant of them in order to try and get rid of the astigmatism also. But again, discuss this with your surgeon, but I'm actually quite a big fan of them. I think they work very, very well. But you've got to be realistic about your expectations. If you want guaranteed, well, again, no get guarantee, but if you want the best chance of distant, inter intermediate, and near vision without specs on, and you're prepared to put up with the downsides, then maybe the other lenses are better for you. But these lenses, they're predictable, they're safe, very few side effects, and they seem to work very well to give you more depth of focus and visual quality of light, which I think is important.